Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. It's James and Taylor from Living Behind the Castle. Guys, we're here at Hollywood Studios today. We're halfway through our what's open, what's closed at Disney World. So follow along with us as we show you what's open and closed today. Let's go guys. One thing I didn't mention in our last video is that the trams at all parks are currently not running. Walking down Sunset Boulevard and we've got Legends of Hollywood is actually open. However, Beverly Sunset Boutique is closed. The shops on the right are open and the ones on the left are closed. Anaheim Produce is open. Right inside the Sunset Market, we have Rosie's American Cafe. They are open. They're not open currently, but you can mobile order right here. Fairfax Fair right outside Tower of Terror and Rock and Roller Coaster is not open. They don't even have a menu out anymore. However, you can hop over to Hollywood Scoops Ice Cream and get your ice cream fix. Beauty and the Beast is right up those stairs in the Theater of the Stars, and unfortunately, it's not running right now. We do miss this show a lot. Currently, Fantasmic is not open right now. And currently, Tower of Terror and Rock and Roller Coaster are using the cues from Fantasmic just to keep up with social distancing guidelines. Currently, pre-shows are actually not going on either. I really wish we had some backstage passes. We just, we just got off Rock and Roller Coaster, and I don't think that ride ever gets old. Oh, it's so much fun. Right next to Rock and Roller Coaster is Lightning McQueen's Racing Academy. This is a show that you go in and sit down and Lightning McQueen comes up. Um, no live actors in this show, but it is open with social distancing in place, of course. It is open 9 to 7 today, so I think it closes roughly an hour before closing. The Hollywood Brown Derby is open, and you can get your reservations for this table service restaurant on your My Disney Experience app. Over here in the Disney Junior Courtyard, of course the character meet and greets are not happening, so all of this is shut down. However, Disney Junior Dance Party is happening. It is a modified version, I've heard, and there are some live actors in there. We have not been in there. We may go check it out today. We'll see. If we do, we'll put the footage here. Star Wars Launch Bay, of course, is closed. That is where the Star Wars character meet and greets are typically happening. It is currently a relaxation station. The Disney Junior Studio Store is closed. But check out that Mighty Ducks Game Changer advertisement. We're really enjoying this show on Disney Plus. Voyage of the Little Mermaid is also currently not operating. However, that show has been rumored that it has officially closed, but it's also been rumored that it's getting an update. So I don't know what's going on. Hopefully that one comes back in some capacity. I would love an update on that one. For the first time in forever, Frozen sing-along celebration is currently running with social distancing in place. And they do run every hour on the 30, so from 10.30 to 7.30. So be sure to check this one out. It is a family favorite. Vacation Fun, an original Mickey and Minnie short over here at Hollywood Studios, is currently operating. They run the show every 10 minutes and it's a great short film. We absolutely love it. It debuted on the day that Mickey and Minnie's Runaway Railway opened just over a year ago now. Indiana Jones Epic Stunt Spectacular Show is not currently operating. However, it is a relaxation station that I didn't know about. This is new to me. And while we're not covering all of the kiosks that are open, Epic Eats is open, so be sure to get your funnel cakes. Seems like anytime we come to Hollywood Studios, we have to ride Mickey and Minnie's Runaway Railway. We just cannot miss it. Yeah, Mickey and Minnie Mouse's handprints. I don't know if you've ever noticed, but Daisy has pond water. Minnie, save Mickey! ABC Commissary is open. This is a quick serve that you use your mobile order from your My Disney Experience app. This is where Mickey and Minnie usually meet, but they are not doing that right now. Sci-Fi Dine-In Theater is open. It's a table service and you get your reservations. Yep, 
on the My Disney Experience app. Baseline Tap House is a bar and they're open from 11 to 7. And they also have snacks. We're over here by Pizza Rizzo. This is where we're going to have lunch. And it is open for mobile order as well. Riverside Antique has a lot of really cool ornaments, but unfortunately they are closed. Mama Melrose is a table service that's open from 11 to 7. And the Stage 1 Company store is actually closed right now. We did just see here at Pizza Rizzo in Hollywood Studios, and the pizza was actually extremely good. The crust was very flaky and actually kind of thick, and we actually got a drink and some applesauce. It's very good. I highly recommend it. Pretty much everything here at Star Wars Galaxy's Edge is open, and that's actually the line to get inside this market to visit the shops. We did talk to a cast member, and she said for Savi's Workshop and the Joy Depot, you have to make your reservation 60 days, well, I guess up to 60 days in advance, in order to get this building opportunity. And you can make those reservations right in your My Disney Experience app, just like you're going to do a dining reservation. I do love that we get to see some shows out here. Oh my gosh, this is just so great looking. And I know, as some of you guys may not know, Disney did just announce that you can actually take your face coverings off while taking your photos. We got a little glimpse of it right to the right of us. I think that's a huge step. Over here in Toy Story Land, and just like over at Galaxy's Edge, everything's pretty much open. Woody's Lunchbox is right over there. This is a quick serve, and you have to have your mobile order in before you can get inside. Make sure to get those tents quick. They fill up fast. Right over here is Woody's Roundup Rodeo Barbecue. Man, that is a tongue twister. There's a concept art, and it's going to be just right back here. At this point, we don't actually have an opening date for Woody's Rodeo Roundup, but... Barbecue. <laughs> yeah, barbecue. But we are pretty excited. Another place to eat at Hollywood Studios. We did pick up our Jack Jack Num Num cookie, and we're going to head over to the relaxation station to eat it. We just finished our cookie and wanted to head over here to Walt Disney Presents One Man's Dream. This is a great place to learn a little bit more about Mr. Walt Disney himself and see where he started and how he came up with a lot of the ideas that he has. We walked up and we saw Chip and Dale out having a picnic. Can you take a bow? I love these little socially distant meet and greets. Oh, he's dancing. You having a picnic? Yeah? Oh, I love that. Oh, are you full yet? Not yet. You still got to eat it all? <laughs> He's got them in his cheeks. That's so <laughs> awesome. So Chip went all the way over there, and the kids over there were asking him where he got his nut from and which tree it came from, and he pointed over this way. Hollywood and Vine is open for lunch and dinner, and this is a socially distant character dining experience. You can get your reservation on the My Disney Experience app. 50's Prime Time Cafe is open for lunch and dinner. And you get those reservations on your My Disney Experience app. Tyler always talks about this because he loves eating at Mom's house. in line for Tower of Terror and that's where they do Fantasmic. Like I mentioned it's uh, currently not open. Can't wait for the show to begin. Pretty much everything here on Hollywood Boulevard is open and operating. That includes Starbucks, 
and there's also several different locations of Joffrey's around to get your coffee fix. I'm kind of curious, are you a Starbucks person or a Joffrey's person? Leave a comment down below, let me know. Guys, thank y'all so much for watching this video with us. We really had a blast here at Hollywood Studios letting you guys know what's open and what's closed. Not, not much is closed though. Hollywood no. Studios is pretty much open. There's just a few things that are still closed. Hopefully they're coming back soon. Be sure to like, subscribe, and share this video with your friends if you liked it. And give it a big thumbs up. We'll see you in the next one. Bye. Bye. My heart of fire. Heart on fire. Set my heart of fire.